Welcome to part three of Yes, my friends, I'm gonna end up calling this We are Spartacus <laughs> And each part will be named a different chapter I guess so in this chapter It'll be my thoughts on Jesse Ventura and you're like wait a second. He's talking about presidential candidates and he brings up Jesse Ventura. Yes, in my last segment, I talked about uh, Donald Trump and Ron Paul. Those two, all right? So who knows, maybe I'll end up talking about more in this one. But the reason why I bring up Jesse Ventura, he is thinking about running for president. He will not run as a Repub Republican and Democrat. He is just like me. I will never run as a Republican or a Democrat. Once again, go back to the first part of my trail. I was, I ran with the Unity Party. I ran a, as a conservative with the Unity Party and I threw out friendship flags to the Democrats to make them show, to show them that the time in 2008 when I ran with the Unity Party was their last chance to run as conservatives with the Democrat Party because the progressives, which are Nazis, fascist Nazis who are in control right now, they're not communists, my friends. They're Nazis, they're fascist Nazis. We have to get rid of this, this traitor in chief we call Barack Insane Obama. He has to resign. That's why I'm calling this We Are Spartacus. We are Spartacus, my friends. This is a rebellion. This is an info war. The info war, information revolution is on, man. You can't get out of it. You're either gonna listen to the mainstream media, which is lies, and him, or and be anti-American. You're either anti-American, you're with us or against us. You're if you're a, if you're a liberal and you're you're making a stand against tea parties and conservatives, you're anti-American, man. There's no way around it. You can't get around it. It is all on the table. And back to Jesse Ventura. If, if Ron Paul loses as a Republican, he uh there's some kind of rules where he can actually run as an independent. And that's the only way Jesse, Ven Jesse Ventura wants to be his running mate. So that's why I'm bringing up Jesse Ventura. And I'm talking to Ron Paul in this one. So this is with Jesse Ventura, Ron Paul. Listen, Ron Paul, we love you. I know, I guess he's like in a, he's a rock in a hard place where I don't know all the rules where he has to run for Congress too. So if he, if he gets out of the Republican Party, he can lose his congressional seat, which, uh, and he leaves, you know what I mean? He leaves again and he runs as president and runs for Congress. He can't do both. So Jesse Ventura, I think you should talk to someone else about running for you running for president because as you can see they want a man like the the people and I myself are looking for a man and my dear friend I call you friend because I admire you I admire your patriotism like you said don't start the revolution without me in your one book buy it go out and buy Jesse Ventura's new book I don't know the name of it but I'll post it with this with this with a blog but uh, yeah, Jesse, uh, if you run as a third party candidate and you're looking for a staff member, just call me up, man. I think I'd love to be, help you win this election and, and uh, being a voice for you soldiers and you veterans, I, I, uh, I stand with that offer. But if you don't contact me, it's okay. I just hope you listen to this video and think about it because I think Ron Paul's in a hard place, rock a hard place. But Ron Paul, you have to think about this. If you lose the nominee for Republican, 
and you run like you did last time and you don't run as an independent but just think yeah think about it this way so what if you lose a, a, I think going for it all in this election is the way to go because if you don't go for it all Ron Paul uh, and, and run with Jesse Ventura as your running mate we're gonna lose America anyway because whoever the Republicans put into office isn't gonna win against Obama they already got the money they got the media they got the shit they're gonna pile the shit so deep on that asshole that we'll never get him out of there so let's go see you in part four let's get it on we are Spartacus <laughs>